How to go to school. Going to school is a necessary part of growing up. To keep school as stress-free as possible, you can learn to prepare for any level of school, get through your day with as little hassle as possible, and try to have some fun along the way. Before going into details, don't forget to subscribe my channel. Part 1 Getting Prepared. Get the necessary school supplies. One of your big responsibilities is to make sure that you have everything you need to be successful at school. Many times, teachers will make supply lists available a few weeks before school starts to make sure you have enough time to get everything you need. Whether you're starting a new school or just returning after a summer break, some common supplies include pencils, pens, notebook paper, crayons, binders, or folders, glue, an eraser, a ruler, highlighters, exercise books. Learn your class schedule. Before you go to school, you need to make sure you know where you're going when you get there. Depending on what level of school you're in, you might just have one classroom, or you may have to go between classrooms. If you're in middle school or junior high school, it's common to go and walk your class schedule once you find out where your classrooms will be. Find out how long the passing period is and make sure you'll have enough time to get to each class. A little practice helps. Figure out the bus route. Many students take the bus to school, which is usually the easiest way of getting there but there are all kinds of different ways to get to school. If you live close enough, you can walk, ride a bike, or get a ride from someone. Usually, the school makes bus routes available before the year starts, so you can find out where and when you need to catch the bus to get to school. Decide what you'll wear. To make the morning before school as easy and stress-free as possible, decide what you're going to wear the night before you have to go to school. Lay out your clothes, take a bath or shower, and get as much sleep as possible so you'll be ready for the first day. It's always a good idea to eat breakfast in the morning before school to keep your energy levels high until lunchtime. Why oh you don't want to be sluggish on your first day. If you're bringing a lunch, pack it the night before and keep it in the fridge so all you've got to do is grab it and go. Get to school on time. However you're getting to school, it's important to show up on time, especially on the first day. Once you get to school, try not to waste too much time talking to your friends and messing around at your locker and just head to class as quickly as possible. Part 2 Doing well in school. Listen to the teacher and follow instructions. When you get to class, try to stay focused on doing what your teacher says. In the first few days of each semester, you'll probably have a lot of introduction activities to do, mostly getting to know the other students and the teacher. It shouldn't be too difficult, but it's still important to listen closely, do what you're told, and pay attention to any homework tasks you're supposed to accomplish. 6. Be quiet in class and avoid talking to your friends. It's important to establish early in the semester that you're a good student and not get started off on the wrong foot. Take notes. You'll probably have a lot of new stuff to keep track of in the early days of your new school, and it's important to keep them written down in your notebook. Try to keep track of each homework assignment, as well as what you're learning about your various subjects. It can be hard to remember everything, so you definitely need to write it down. Keep organized by having a different notebook for each subject, or having a few sheets of paper in each folder you have for different classes to keep your notes separated. Participate in class. Answer questions occasionally when the teacher opens up and contribute to class discussions. Do the assignments that your teacher provides in a timely manner. When you're in class, try to participate as much as possible and stay on task to establish that you're a good student and a contribution to the class. Ask questions when you don't understand something. If you don't understand something, don't wait for someone else to ask to clarify. If you're confused, it's likely that someone else is confused too and that you're doing them a favor. Teachers usually appreciate when students are brave enough to ask questions and make sure that everyone is getting the concept or the idea that's being taught. Stay organized. Keep your binders, folders, and backpack well organized and as clean as possible. Make sure you can find everything you need for class quickly and effectively and keep your homework assignments tidy and in the front of your folders. If you're a messy student, try to get in the habit of going through your backpack and binder every couple of weeks to get things cleaned out. If you've got old papers that aren't important anymore, it can be a big stress reducer to throw stuff out and get rid of it. Keep a paper or digital calendar to write all of your homework, upcoming tests, and assignments in so you don't forget 